I'm Steve Tang. I'm the president and CEO of the University City Science Center. The Science Center has been at the intersection of innovation and economic development. You could say we're growing our economy one idea, one job at a time. We invite you to join us as we grow these companies and have an impact on our region in ways that we can only begin to dream of today. We felt there was a void for a accessible rapid diagnostic. We're in 24 countries globally. Uh, we've got about 300, 350 clients worldwide that have our molecular system under their roof. The membrane proteins that we work on are involved in a wide variety of different diseases such as cancer, viral infections, autoimmune disorders. At the end of the day what we wanted to do is we didn't want to just build products to build products. We wanted to make a difference. We wanted to make the world a safer place. Entrepreneur Magazine just named us one of the top 10 wearables in the world. Um, Reclare just named us the wearable to get this year. Now we learned the 30 seconds you can go in and um, take an analysis that's going to be spread out you know citywide. Push it from your app on screens across the building and elsewhere, uh, which is something that was never possible before. It started with two people uh, working in an early science center incubator lab and uh, very quickly grew to 100 people in five years and we're you know, well over 130 people today. We've grown from one facility where we could manufacture our product and do clinical trials to a, a network of almost 90 sites that manufacture our product around the world. Early on with the Science Center, it was more the physical resources, but now it's really the opportunities that they bring on you know, a weekly, a monthly basis. There was an opportunity to come here, to have the shared equipment, to have the lab space we needed. They've got good grant writers also. Being able to land in a lab that was fully equipped with centrifuges and incubators and tissue culture hoods, you know, everything down to pipettes and pipette tips the time so we were able to pretty much just walk right in and start doing experiments. You get immediate access to resources that you won't get in an office space. It's not only the resources at the Science Center you know and at Penn and Drexel and the other city universities but it's access to the people. The IC at 3401, the Innovation Center, has been great at being able to accommodate us, help us find connections, resources. Just being able to go down and see what people are talking about, like all the cool stuff that's happening in the Science Center and being able to connect with them, maybe potentially collaborate with them. Here, a Science Center keeps, um, as part of their quorum programming, they keep entrepreneur office hours. These are successful entrepreneurs that come in uh, and help entrepreneurs like us kind of understand what's going on. We've been able to recruit the top scientists in their field to relocate their families here to Philadelphia and be part of this organization. Each one of the tenants here is doing something great, whether it's research in, uh, on the biomedical side or IC3401, which is a co-working space for technology, dream adventures. We all want this to be a destination location for the best in the world. That's why we're expanding our footprint and our impact here at the Science Center. The future of the Science Center is about increasing access and inclusion to our innovation and entrepreneurship community. We want to be part of it. It's a very inviting, uh, exciting, dynamic, dynamic environment. It's, it's a fun place to work. Yeah, we're, we're going to change the world. I'm excited. <laughs>